estate agent. Super excited to introduce you to Maria Kamsak. She is the outreach coordinator with Aaron's Acres. Thank you for being here with I'm me. I'm very excited. I, um, you shared your passion with Aaron's Acres with me. Can you please share with them what this is all about? <laughs> sure. So we're very excited that you're here, Jan, and I really appreciate you taking the time here today. This is our camp yes. um, located at the Mannheim Community Pool, and um, we provide programs for kids with disabilities. Um, we accept every child, no matter what the disability or the inability to pay for camp. Um, we never turn a child away, and that's what, how it all started. Um, a mother was sending her, wanted to send her child, Aaron, to camp, and he had autism, and she called all the camps in the community, and no one accepted her son. So there was a story in the paper, and my executive director, Risa Paskoff, decided to reach out to that mother and say, I'm interested in doing a camp for kids with disabilities. 20 years later, here we are. Um, we have 220 kids at camp this year. We're very excited. Um, 20 years ago, we had 11 kids. So we know that there's a need in the community. Our ages are five to 21. Um, and we do all the activities of a summer camp. We go horseback riding. We have music therapy. We have fitness for focus. It's a very exciting time for these kids to be able to be a typical kid and still do the kinds of things um, that we all do. What and, a gift. Yes, yes. We have, um, we have children with trachs, feeding tubes, um, Down syndrome, autism, all the whole spectrum. And we never turn a child away. So that's why I'm the outreach coordinator and I need to get out in the community to tell people about this. Because even if your child is um, 18 and wears a diaper, we, have, we can have them at camp. Right. We have nurses on staff as well. To help, um, to help their needs. They administer meds um, and they're with the kids at all times. That's amazing, you guys thought of everything. So the kids are protected and they're having a great time and they're doing things they've never done before or never thought they could do before. And just hearing some of the stories, it gives you goosebumps. I mean, they're beautiful, beautiful stories. So if someone wants to know a little bit more about Aaron's Acres, what's the best way for them to reach you? You can reach us at www.aaronsacres.org. Um, we have a lot of great videos, a lot of pictures on there that people can actually see what we're doing here at the camp and the programs that we're providing. Um, our summer camp opens, the applications open on, in January and they fill up very fast. They end in March. Um, so if you're interested, please give us a call for more information if you want to speak with our program director and she could probably give you more information as well. Yes, so again, if you have a child you think would be interested in this, it opens January 2019 every year. So this year's already full up to March. And um, also, can we talk a little bit about staff? Right, so our staff is fully paid. Um, we have over 150 staff members and we're constantly looking for them. They're usually um, kids who are in college who are studying occupational therapy or special education. It gives them a chance to determine whether or not they want to go in this field. Um, some of them also can have internships. We work with a lot of the colleges um, to provide that to them. So we're, we're constantly looking for that staff. Um, we also have some special education teachers, teachers who are on break for the summer, that come here as well. So yes. um, we're, we're always, always looking for those. We are in need of staff members because of the one-to-one -one staff to child ratio. So it leaves the parents um, a little bit more of at ease as they drive away and leave their child with us because of the one-to-one -one, uh, relationship. Yes, I think it's so great that um, a parent can feel comfortable and confident knowing that their child is in good hands because of that. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Bye guys. Bye.